I'm standing right now outside the Cork City Hall, which is Cork's venue for concerts and other live performances. And it's within these grand historic walls that the final of the Eurovision Song Festival for the intellectually disabled will take place on the evening of June the 28th, 2012. 19 excited participants from all across Europe will be performing with a live symphony orchestra in front of 1,200 audience members. Okay, so we're currently in the room where the uh, magic happens. This is where the election and the jury is sitting and trying to decide which of the entries that are entertaining enough to be allowed to participate on the final in, in June. Og hver fum som stemmet, født de et fattig land. Det er ikke plass til de med mindre forstand. Og hver fum som stemmet, er stred som nok for oss. Så la oss hjelpe dem å slå oss. Moldova, å si at det som sker, det raker ikke deg og meg. Moldova, Vi kan ikke ha slike tanker, du og jeg. Was it hard to pick? Uh, Not necessarily, no. You knew everybody was of a different, um, yeah, uh, I suppose, different criteria, let's say, from a choir to people doing duets to doing soloists, yeah. as to what do they have that sort of got mm -hmm. you. Uh, you know, there was times mm. when um, mm. there was two in particular for me, and I just had goosebumps. Yeah. After the first mm. few mm. words they sang, I went, okay. Yeah, um, I suppose um, with, with the DVDs and audios that are sent to us, yeah. um, we'll use them to write the orchestral mm. music. Mm. Um, and from there then we will send out each uh, entrant what we've arranged um, and looking at, the, at mm. it then to make sure they're happy with it. Um, so they'll get an MP3 of what, what the arrangement of their piece mm. is. If they want to add something to it or take something out or something like that, we can we can talk to each other about that, um, and then from there they can rehearse with that themselves at at home in their own country, and then when they come uh, to Cork, they'll know exactly what the orcs will be playing and how we'll be playing it. As well. And do you think some of the more hardcore bands would? prefer to just be playing themselves without their uh, piece have it be being arranged for the orchestra? Uh, uh, maybe, yeah. yeah. Yes, we, we, we'll have to talk to each um, each entrant individually, uh, see what they want and see what we can come up with together. Uh -huh. So how is the uh, balance of people singing standards and their own songs? What did you get the most of? I think it's 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 pretty much 50-50. <laughs> Romance, ra ra ah ah ah, romance, romance, ga ga, ooh la la, one job at romance. 
how do you think the uh, degree, degree of quality on the entries were this year? Well, I was very surprised, as I'm not very familiar with, with these contests, mm. but uh, I thought the standard was very high. Mm. I heard some great singers, uh, and I saw some great performance as well, so mm. I'm very looking forward to the contest in June. Thank you very much. Uh, we really appreciate you coming and uh, thank you for, for the work that you've done today. We really appreciate it. And uh, we'll now go and inform all of the selected people. We will inform them over the next two days that they've been selected. So we have 19 places that will be coming. Thank you. Is everything free of charge or is there tickets for the song festival? Or? What there is is for the international song competition, yeah, yeah. will be a ticketed event, yeah. but all other events yeah. around the city yeah. and the county will yeah. be free to access. Mm. And we will also be holding national competitions in dance, drama and instrumental performance mm -hmm. in different theatres around the city um, and they will be free to go to and, okay. and see if people want. Okay. What will happen here during the festival? So this is one of the areas that we use here for our street performances during the festival. Mm -hmm. um, we'll either set up a stage or section off um, a, a small area of this plaza where groups from all over the country and international groups will come and perform. Mm -hmm. I think what's useful as well about this area yeah. that they're aware that the tourist office is here so yeah. when coming from abroad yeah. if you're looking for the main tourist office in yeah. Cork come to Grand Parade and you'll see it here. And how about accommodation? How will you put people up for the night? What we have is we have options and accommodation which you'll get on our website um, esf2012.eu or else you can find it on irishperformingarts.ie The accommodation that we're going to be using is student accommodation. A lot of the students are gone on their holidays at that time of year so their apartments, each individualised apartments or there might be three separate bedrooms in one block so it's going to be uh, very affordable accommodation we feel somewhere between 65 euros and 120 for seven nights including a continental breakfast oh, okay. otherwise there are uh, different hotels and different things if people want different mm. options uh, but we're recommending that people travel mm. traveling from abroad would use the accommodation that we have set up because we will be providing transport from that area as well as uh, there's public transport from that area in and out of the city when you come to Cork don't forget to visit the famous English market for for the freshest fish, the finest meat, and the uh, friendliest customer service with the greatest knowledge about the food and uh, how to prepare it. It's called an English market, but everything in here is uh, pure Irish. Are we going to see the lobster? Show me. Show me. That one? Or oh, that one? That one. Yeah, that one. Yeah, okay, we get that one. Are we going to shake his hand? Shake his hand. Say hello, lobster. Hello, lobster. First prize winner of the finale of the Eurovision Song Festival, what will the grand prize be? The grand prize right. is, a, is a trophy mm -hmm. acknowledging the winner and the work that the mm -hmm. person or group has put in. Yeah. So it's the European Song Festival trophy. It's mm -hmm. a fine big trophy yeah. and they get to keep that until the next one is held. Okay, so it's like the Euro real Euro Eurovision Song Contest. They have to give it away to the next winner. They can keep that as their trophy from as a memory for life. Oh, well. Yeah. It, Certainly, at the moment, yeah. we're if this competition uh, continues into the future, we yeah. think it's a good idea that it's passed on. Yeah. If it never happens again, yeah. they're more than welcome okay. to keep it. Okay. Congratulations, Jerry.